So you you did boss shuffle. So I wonder if you notice something interesting about the dungeons music. The, yeah, the music shifted around. That that took me a little bit to figure it out. I went to Sky Garden. Uh, I thought this doesn't sound like a Sky Garden music. So do you know why the music changes? Because that's that tells you which boss is where. Yes. Uh, when Shogun did this, um. I actually had to point that one out. And he was like three hours in before it's like. Oh, Goldship has an herb, yay. Yeah. <laughs> Get good. Okay, so if. So I'll actually explain what these. Uh, so if you say run away, they will take you back to the first floor. Because yep. after you finish the second one, uh, you hit a point of no return. Oh yeah, early firebird, baby. <laughs> one cycle, booyah. Yeah, the Firebird's going to make a few of these bosses a joke. And I've got, I've got some herbs in reserve. Just in case I mess up. Is this an open seed or an unopened seed? Open seed. So this actually interesting logic in the non-open seed. Uh, so you need the Lake of Rose to go from the native's the, village to Dao. But you don't need it to go from Dao to Native Village. So it is completely within the Randall logic to need to get enough red jewels to visit the uh, gem, the gem mansion. Yep. Just so you can exit the gem mansion, which will give you, which will spit you back out at Dale. So, some interesting things uh, about the vampires. The only thing that actually damages you is their attack. And of they course. actually... They themselves do not have um, hitboxes that will damage you. Just their attacks. Well, Sandfinger shouldn't be a problem. I'm. Sandfinger is, I'd say, the easiest boss outside of RNG. Yep. That's really the only issue with that boss. It's really the Sandfinger RNG that uh, determines PBs and speedruns for the really good guys. Yeah, Sandfinger shouldn't be a problem. I shouldn't need to use an herb, but I'll probably use one before the Queen just to be safe. So, um, even though the uh, aura stone doesn't, you can't like sink into the ground, it does actually provide you some invulnerability frames. Yep. And people like Say and Solacell will actually use it to actually avoid attacks in Mummy Queen. Goodbye, same finger.
All right, full health. Oh, I didn't. That was a different message. Oh, well. I just. Oh, <laughs> I thought that was a shadow. Oh. Ah, uh, this is why uh, Moo didn't have any buff. Didn't. Different music. If the boss has, uh, if a dungeon has vanilla music, dungeon music, that tells you you have the Mummy Queen app. Okay, that, that was weird, because uh, I ran to the Mummy Queen at the end of Sky Garden after a glitch. Yeah, I can just tank this. This will be giving you... I should have said you won, yep. Ooh, got him! <laughs> it's hard to do that fight without... Uh, at least having freedom. Don't forget to talk to the blue-haired person on the top of the boat. Or, yep. Well, not top of the boat. Uh, it should be, like, right next to you. Yep, got an herb. Uh, you actually want to go down and... Too late. ...the hold? Ah, <laughs> oh, shoot. Well, can I uh, go back there? Yes. Okay. You would just have to climb the tower again. Oh, fortunately. Yeah, the statue. <laughs> Kinda wanna get that. Well, that wasn't too bad at least. If I can find that last hieroglyph piece, hopefully we don't have to go through the pyramid. I'll get to see what the Viper says as well. Now that has to get shared into the... Yeah, in a couple of places. I think, uh, well, Mount Crest is still open. I haven't been there yet. Uh, I think that's the only place I haven't been to at all yet. I need a, I need the other Statue of Hope for Moo. Oh, too far into my back. And I can't finish the Diamond Mine without the keys. My... Honest opinion uh, would be do pyramid. There's a lot more checks in pyramid than than anywhere else. Yep. There's like twelve. Okay, get the actual statue. And his ritual. All right. Okay, it's not the queen that has it. Uh, no, it's a uh, basement chest. We have five in Mount Temple. If you did no checks in pyramid, there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 
Yeah, 12. Okay. That's that sail to leave. Anyway, finally one of the statues that we need to progress. Uh, back to Dow, so yep, well, try the pyramid. Uh, did, did you get any items in pyramid? No, except for except for what Gaia gives. Okay, so when you uh, oh yeah, you didn't have uh, so when you uh, uh, shimmer down, um, you want to shimmer down on the right neck on the uh, right exit of pyramid for an item. Okay, right, because there's the red jewel there in vanilla. Oh, baby, <laughs> the firebird is going to make this place so fun. Okay, goes in the second. <laughs> and Dexter's 1066, thank you for the follow. Actually, uh, nothing in there. Yes, there is. It's you have to check the left column. Oh, derp! Thought it was a treasure chest. No. Where's the teleporter to get back up? <laughs> it's on the right side. Uh, because uh, enemizer. Oh. It's a. Yeah. Could be a dip. It might will be a should be a different tile. Yep. That, that caught me off guard. Oh, no, oh, dark fire improvement. I thought you can only upgrade it once, unless that's just a. No, there are two upgrades. The first upgrade allows when it hits an enemy, uh, it'll split up into four. Uh, with two upgrades, as I talked about in Inco Bot, after you discharge a Dark Flare, you can push the attack button again uh, to uh, trigger the, uh, the quad splitting on demand. Oh, gotta switch back to Will. Which allows you not to need a Earthquaker. I yeah. might as well just do, do the bottom floors as well, if I remember correctly. There's some that you have to do as well, some you have to do as Shadow. Yeah, it's been a while. Well, Dexters, if you get the chance to try out the rando, it's a nice way to revisit the game. Yes. But it is one of my old favorites as well. Okay, no, no extra items in here. And I took the wrong way. <laughs> Yeah, the boss in here is going to be Sandfanger. Yep, that's the, uh... I had to unmute the stream. So I could actually hear the music just to verify.
There's my strength upgrade. Ooh. Okay, no upgrades in here. I've heard about the fan remake, I haven't seen much progress on that, though. Uh, you'll actually need to go up left first, because distance. Uh, so the issue is your uh, spin dash won't actually be able to make it up by itself. It yep. needs down ramp. Give it enough juice. Dang it, giant worm, stop spawning on me. Red jewel. <laughs> If I remember correctly, the f also from the fourth from the left is also another one where I need Will. The rest can be done with Shadow. I believe so. Find out. Also, yeah, four uh, actually does need will. Also, if you're going to switch to will, or, um, you can do the first part of room of room three as well. I think there was a hidden breakable floor somewhere. I don't know if this was it or not. Something somebody discovered by accident. I don't think that was it. I can see it crumbling. Okay. Let's sink down a shadow. <laughs> nice panicky firebird there, Shadow. Okay, got one, got one treasure in here. Don't want to forget that. I actually wonder if this is it. Another red jewel. And you want to fall down the hole. Yep, get the treasure. Oh, nerb. <laughs> I'll take it though. And no power up. I do need to finish Moo to fight the Mummy Queen. I need the other Rama statue. Rama. And the other statue of hope. I'll worry about that. Let's finish this place first. Alright, got 
that item. Power up though. Oh, I need Will. Yes. Um, I would. So this is the the second half of the room is, as I said, is uh, ref collectively referred to as Kalisa. So the rando is supposed to have it where. Uh, the odds of getting something in Killer 6 is less likely. Now, if you had asked me if I think that actually tends to be true, <laughs> I feel it's still like 50-50. Oh, I don't see any change. Oh, I see the treasure. Uh, turn around. <laughs> oh, the red jewel, yay. Yeah, I think There's I... actually two items in that room, in that path, but you have to come back to site to get to the other one. Yep. Yeah, that, that's, a, that's what makes this dungeon annoying. It it, it actually be uh, a bit nicer if you, when you jumped into the portal, it took you to the bottom of that first room, and then you, if you need to go to the top, you just take that second portal. That would make this a lot more tolerable. Sinking down, sinking down, sinking down. Alright. Oh, power up. Hey, anchor water enemies, yay. <laughs> Actually, the other floating head was over here. Zombie has slowly going downstairs. See ya. All right. Well, you're the <laughs> you're the teleporter. There's no point for you to need to clear this room because you'll still get the staff boost from the boss. I know. I, I I just like to be thorough at times. Plus the free heal is nice too. Now the question is, if the boss is Sandfinger, do I get the stat boost based on the Great Wall of China or here? Oh wait, uh, yeah, that would. I think it's the Great Wall of China. Uh, where would the... And yeah, I think it's normal Mummy Queen would give you stat. And yeah, Mummy Queen is... Uh, in Sky, pa in Sky Garden. I'm missing two crystals, though. Oh, been almost nothing but red jewels in here so far. <laughs> This is a weird scene. 
It's normally not the case. I can't remember the last ever game is trying to see that nothing important was in Pyramid. Let's see. I thought one of these was a hidden stairwell. There's one. Oh, no power up, no treasure. Let's go for the hieroglyph. Yeah, I did, because I need I need Will for that one. Okay. I about to say, wait, this doesn't look like... Why did I think you did room? I skipped three and four for now. Oh, that was a... Wrong way. But it feels so nice to go through with the Firebird. There we go. Yes, it does. <laughs> the red jewel. Well, how many herbs do you have? Uh, I have like eight herbs at the moment. I don't know about red jewels. I haven't turned them in quite a while. Or checked with Jim. Actually. Wrong dark you space. Actually, now that I think about it, I think those uh, breakable floors, you have to be as will. The shadow technically doesn't have any weight. Jewel. <laughs> All red jewels, and I think like one herb in here so far. And now to do the second half of the room, you either have to be uh, Freedon or or Shadow. Uh, Shadow. Yep. I'll just I'll just I'll just do room four and then come back to Shadow. The as I said, the second half of this room is the killer six. Statistically, is. It, we've actually changed it in the Zoranda to have the odds of being something important to be less likely. Yeah, just ignore all those ignore all those guys. <laughs> oh, plus one defense. I had a treasure. Oh, we got uh There we go. The 
those stupid invisible heads. I do want the defense upgrade, so I will kill everything. Oh, that was just annoying positioning. And of course those spirits don't count as enemies, but... There we are. Alright, back across the spike ceiling. Hopefully we won't need an herb, but there are only four enemies in the next room. Oh, whatever works. <laughs> hey, HP upgrade! <laughs> it wasn't a red jewel! Yep, at least you have that. Yep. Alright, back to Shadow, finish room 3, and then finish up this place. <laughs> Well, I can fight the boss, unfortunately. Are you doing Z3 mode? No. Okay. I, I, I was thinking about it, but I decided not to on my first run here. I may do it on my next one. Well, it's just I find Z3 mode uh, tends to be easier than... Actually, I'm trying to remember something. In Edward's Castle, was there something in the non-dungeon area other than the Leg of Yak? I'm trying to remember if there was... Uh, uh, there is a hint, but other than that, no. Okay, I thought there was another item in there. Or... If you talk to the guard uh, that's guarding uh, Kara's room, he will give you a hint. Okay. Yeah, this one's pretty straightforward. A lot of enemies. Actually, I'm more forgiving than animizer. Vanilla room, it's... Oh yeah, uh, the stairs move a lot faster. Thank Baku for that. Uh, also, you'll notice it's also the um, elevator in uh, Diamond Mine is ridiculously fast. Oh yeah, that, that caught me off guard. It was funny. 
And last hieroglyph, Red Jewel! <laughs> Well, that's everything we can do in the pyramid. <laughs> see what, uh, I would actually see what, uh, the red, uh, what Jim has. Uh, he's got, he's got like one more red jewel and an herb for me. We'll see if you have enough to, uh, uh get into the, uh, mansion. Right, that's it. see if you... Because there's one item in the mansion. True that. Oh, for now I'm gonna return to South Cape. 